Hey guys, good evening and welcome to my exciting channel where the fun never ends with Mandela Effects. Thank you for joining in today. Welcome all Mandela Effecting. So, uh, this this one's kind of weird. Um, as I was researching the Twin Towers, okay, 9-11, uh, World Trade Center, there is this discussion right now going on in Facebook and YouTube whether or not there were uh, bridges connecting the two buildings. And this is, these are the Patronus Twin Towers in Kuala Lumpur. Yeah, I, I, I'm envisioning that right now with the bridges. I don't remember there being uh, tunnels between the two buildings like that or um, pathways. But as we see here, it says, this. I love this meme. I'm going to save this photo. Geek World wonders if the Super Mario Brothers movie is the devil. And this is a FEMA photo taken during 9-11. This is the image of the Super Mario Brothers, the movie. But look at look at those twin towers. All right. And there's Koopa's markings on the building, which is like reptilian anyway. But look at these land bridges, folks. These bridges between the two buildings. That's what it looks like if you watch the movie. So there, maybe there was that, but not from my memory, but maybe... You guys could help me out here. Any of you that are from New York City or anything that could pro possibly help me out here. But if you look, there's these bridges between the two buildings. And then Teresa sends me this uh, picture right here inside the sky bridge between the Twin Towers. And I, I understand this is probably um, the one in uh, Kampur, wherever that place is. Uh, we have this image right here. Okay? Lumpur, I mean. So... And that led me to talk to look up the Super Mario Brothers, right? So I'm looking at Super Mario Brothers logo from 1985 up until now. Look at the freaking logo. Was it always like that to you guys? I, I no, uh, not to me. The R's were connected; they weren't broken, and the B was connected. This R right here was normal. The E was normal. The P was normal. The S wasn't like a Pac-Man right here at the top and bottom so let me trace this for you guys so that way we have some kind of residue from 1985 up until now it's been like this I am calling BS on this one I played Super Mario Brothers probably 50,000 times in my life you know I know that's maybe an exaggeration but I'm telling you I don't remember the logo being like this and the E's broken up too by the way E has a break in it right here so um, yeah the R we're seeing all these funky looking broken up R's and B's. Uh, it just goes to show you that not everything in this world is as we as we as it seems. And I am telling you, this to me, I think may be a possible Mandela effect. Uh, let me know what you guys think. I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna show you some more residue. Uh, hold on, check this out. Uh, let's see, it R. I'm just trying to make sure we have some kind of residue for later on. And for all of you that are out there watching, uh, Richie from Boston has reported recently um, that his videos are being taken down. After he reached um, 666 videos, they started uh, tampering with his videos, and, and he's getting harassed right now. Let's all pray for him, okay? Richie from Boston. Um, but we're trying. they don't like us getting the message out. There's something with this 666 going on here that's just demonic. So we must follow the light of Christ in all things. Jesus Christ, please protect us. Um, okay, last letter, I'm on the S. Okay, and of course the period is, is a uh, square. Okay, so there, we have a tracing in case it changes again. I just can't believe that, folks. I didn't believe Logopedia when I first saw it, but look at the freaking video game. I'm telling you, this S was not a Pac-Man looking S. And it just, it hurts me to see this, you know? I can't believe it was always like that. Look at Super Mario Brothers 2, folks, 1988. Look at that. These were normal letters. I can't believe that. And somebody, I think it might have been Salted Cedar, or um, somebody mentioned to me about the T in Nintendo. Notice how it looks like a cross. Um, the, the T seems to be more flattened 
up here and I didn't believe that it changed part part of you wants to not accept the um, the old reality but I think the T was just a slight bit thicker I think the T was actually a double the thickness across so um, let me trace this in case it changes okay it's all red lettering wait sorry let's trace this yeah I'm seeing a lot of stuff going on in the 80s okay now I'm tracing this part whoops guys uh, try to keep track of my tracings Again, this parts flat up here and up down low um, yeah, this is so nuts guys Yeah, block lettering okay none of these letters are connected by the way yeah everything is subject to change nothing is as we know it anymore in case my tracing changes you know that the E looks funky it looks like serpent like toward the bottom um, the E has like a half circle in it it's great yeah but the T looks really messed up the, the T bar looks super thin okay whoops okay and I, I thank you all for taking the time to watch my video please hit the like and subscribe if you're new to my channel uh, Rena Jaseel has also sent me some residue. By the way, there's a copyright R right there. Um, so I'm looking at Super Mario Brothers, the uh, the movie. You know, don't you think if they made a movie about the game, the lettering would be just like the video game? Um, there's Super Mario Brothers, the movie logo. They didn't include the period there. Um, Apparently it's always been like, look, check this out. Super Mario Brothers 2. I, I just, I have a hard time wrapping my mind around that. There's Super Mario Brothers. You see everything's normal with the Super, but then the Mario Brothers is all normal. Okay? Like the way I remember it. Um, here's a t-shirt. Super Mario Brothers. This is from the fifth son.com notice how that's all normal I don't know we're talking about the video game logo here's Super Mario Brothers it's like a drawing um, Super Mario Brothers box special art 30th birthday so this is how this person remembers it Super Mario Brothers no, nothing broken everything's normal and then we see this right here Super Mario Brothers right um, this one's a little bit peculiar look at the um, this person drew it and notice the letters are sort of normal it's the E actually the E is not broken up you see that and that first S is not a Pac-Man S that's the first two things I noticed but yeah I mean the R's are broken up a little bit I see that and the B and this R. So I just want to bring that to your attention. This is definitely an anomaly. I'm going to report it as a possibility. But yeah, thanks guys for checking me out. And as usual, have a great Mandel Effect Day and God bless.